Hi everybody, travel time, that means off and go on the road and everywhere. So these exercises you can do everywhere, in the hotel, even in the hotel bed, on the floor, whatsoever. You don't need anything, just yourself and a mat or something underneath you. Alright, so we're going to start lying up to the side. I'm going to lie on my right side, stretching the right arm straight out and bringing both knees into your chest as good as you can bring it towards you. If you need a pillow for your head, you can have a pillow, otherwise let the head rest and have a good stretch there. As you inhale, reach the left arm over. As you exhale, let it glide over your top arm. Bring the elbow back behind you and stretch the arm straight out. Bend the elbow again, bring it back forward. Rotate and tease up, may look back behind you, turn the head back to neutral and let the head follow the elbow, open the arm out and bring it back in again. It's a great morning stretch, midday stretch for your mid back and breathe into the mid back, allow the rib cage to move and bring it back. Then take the bottom arm, your right arm, and place it underneath your head if you don't have a pillow there, and stretch the top leg long way. Create length and space on here, so you feel a little lift underneath your right side, and then just slightly lift and lower the leg up and down for five, four, three, two, one. Bring the leg slightly forward and repeat, waking up the glutes, and breathe into it five four three two and one and bring it back let it stretch down bring your arm overhead and hold on your wrist and just breathe into that stretch good gently relax and return for the other side and i'm just going to flip around so you don't see my knee end stretching the left arm in front of you Knees bend in towards you, head rest. Feel your shoulders good stacked, knees good stacked. Reach the top arm forward and then glide it over your forearm, over your chest. Let the elbow be heavy, stretch the arm out. Bend the elbow, place your head, lift the head slightly, rotate in and rotate back again. Keep breathing. Inhale, return, exhale, one more time, inhale, open, you always can hang out a little bit here, you feel it's nice in the pecs, don't feel any strain in the lower back, if you feel any strain in the lower back, bring your knees up even higher, alright, then bring your left arm underneath you, right hand down and straight that right leg long away. Create that space and that length again and have your right hand flat down and a little stretch in your wrist as you lengthen stretch that leg out. Your course you can do 50 of these if you like or keep the short and then bring it slightly in front of you and go a couple more. Get that glute leg up your booty. Last four, three, two, one. Bring it back underneath you, stretch it out, reach your arm overhead and breathe into that stretch. Nice. Then relax and come on all fours. Once you're on all fours, hands underneath your shoulders. Good. And then slightly just hinge back your hips and back forward. Just find yourself in space. Hold it, exhale, round into your pet. Inhale, stretch out. One more time, exhale, round. Inhale, stretch out. Find neutral, equal weight on both hands. And then we're gonna lift the right leg up and in, fire hybrid. Open it out to the side and bring it in. You warmed it up already before, now just changing it a little bit. Four, three, two, so we're doing eight and eight. Then we're going to circles and do five in each direction. Good, three more to go. You got this. As good as it feels good for you. And one. Changing your direction. And 
One, two, three, four, and five. Then bring your left knee a little bit into the center. Cross the right leg over the left. Separate the feet and sit down onto your glutes. Getting a good stretch in your hips. You can keep the feet like this or you bring it a little bit forward. And then you can hinge a little bit forward and bring it into that stretch and get a good performer stretch, a little bit different. So it's not about you resting a little bit. Keep your spine straight. Breathe into that glute. Slowly release. Uncross your leg. Come back on all fours. Now we're going to do the other side. You get the left side, open and close. Two. Heel equal weight as good as you can on both hands. Don't have your head hang down. Keep the head lifted. And good. Last two. One. Then we have the five circles. And five, four, three, two, one. Reverse it. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bring your right knee to the center. Cross the left over. I'm going to turn it to you this time so you can see it. So the knee is going to be on top of each other as good as you can have it. Feet are flex and hinge forward and just enjoy. We have one more breath cycle. Then lift yourself up and then lie on your back. Once you're on your back, Feet are flat down, arms long beside you. Exhale, tuck the pelvis, inhale, release. So imagining your pelvis is a bowl and you have a little wad in there and you're just gonna tilt that pelvis so that water rolls slightly towards your belly button. Good. Now let it slightly shift to the right hip, to the left hip, just small. and then back to the center. Then you tilt it and bring the ball back in, so the water falls to the belly button. Then we're gonna make a circle over to the left hip, down to the pubic bone, over to the right hip, back into the belly button, and relax. That's your pelvic tuck. Let's relax it. Tuck it in, and circle the opposite way around. You can imagine a clock around your belly button and it goes around. Or you can imagine a roulette table and the pearl circles all around. And then let's do one more. So you're alternating and then hold the center. Bring one leg in tabletop, other leg in tabletop. Place both hands onto your quads, press the quads into the legs and the legs into the quads and feel that fire in the abs. Hold that fire as you now lower the right foot down and bring it back up to your hand. And lower and lift. One more time, lower and lift. Let's change. Inhale, exhale. You don't have to touch the floor. If you feel your back is arching, don't do it. Good. Then bring both hands beside you and alternate right and left. If you need the hand spare for you to just give you a stop, then please keep them there. If you need a pillow underneath your head because you're arching the neck, please do that too. Neck and jaw should be relaxed. And last one. Draw one foot down, other foot down. Let the feet come together, let the soles of your touch, let the knees open and then lift the knees slightly up. And then press down to the outside of the feet and lift the hips straight up. Good, stretching the hips, working the glutes, and lower back down. And lift, and lower. One more time, 
Nick. If it feels so good for you, you can always pay to upholster us on the knees here and just hang out in the stretch. Lens you back down, bring your knees together, bring them into your chest. Exhale, lift the head and shoulders, place your left hand on the right knee, right hand on to the base of the shin, stretch out, the single leg stretch. And hold, pull and switch, and switch. Exhale, exhale, inhale, good. Let's do five more, and four, good, and three, and two, and one. Bend the knees in, rest the head down, turn the head to one side and to the other side. Hands behind the head or underneath your tailbone. Let your elbows slightly hover. Exhale, lift the head and shoulders. If you need support for the lower back, hands underneath the glutes. Inhale, lower the legs down. Exhale, lift them up. Fire into your lower abs. Breathe into them. Inhale and exhale. And four more. Good. And three. And two. And one. Bend the knees in. Rest the head. Hands behind your sides. And just rock up and come back on all fours. Good. Stretch one leg behind you. Push the heel away. Feel that stretch in your calf. Mm. It's always also a good one after you went for a walk. Or you have your high shoes on, lady. And change. Good. Release off a little bit. Have your weight into your hands. Engage the core. Bring your other foot out there. And there we are in our plank. And then focus on your breast. Push your hands into the floor. Feel the head reaching forward, so don't let the head drop down. Feel the neck lengthening. Feel your heels reaching back. And inhale and exhale. Feel the shake in the body. Now everything is strong and engaged for your day, for your night, whatever, whenever you do it. Keep breathing, keep pushing. Good. Five, four, three, two. Soften the knees. Come into a child's pose. And roll it out. And voila, we did it. Ready for the day, ready for the night, midday, whatever it is, always good to move. Enjoy your time with.